Jeez, look at all these chests. Hey, look at that, a side quest. Wait, we should hold off. Yeah, 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 you can do that. I'm just, um... I need to take, I need to go back Hello, home sir. real quick. Might you have some time to talk? I have all the time in the world for a potential customer. <laughs> How do you do? I'm Cromwell, Tiffin Cromwell. Hello, Mr. Cromwell. Uh, let's see what you have. What do you have for sale? Ah, yes. What can I do for you? Eh. I've got all of these, but you can at least... Take all these items, filling up my inventory. With you. It's amusing that we've reached a point where, like, none of these items, so, like, so many of these items are just not above what we currently have. Like, beforehand, a lot of items were always above, like every single thing we got was Short at least plus one again. above our stuff. Always brightens my day, helping you young ones. It's not happening now. All right. Well, we'll ask him all of his uh, little, all the questions about his town when we come back. Unfortunately, we took a little bit too much time, so the demi guys will have to just wait a little bit. Niffler statue, adorable. Mm, this place looks a lot less intimidating with the light shining on it. That's nice. Could it? Uh, could it? Could it? Could it? What? Whoa! <laughs> Are those bigger duck bugs, or am I just? Okay, maybe they're not bigger duck bugs. Maybe it's just a perspective trick. Um, I did hit. Won't get the best of me. He did try to be a little tricky there. How many more Merlin? How many more Merlin trials do I need? Uh, challenges. Exploration. We need eight more. That is not bad. Oh shit. Oh, <laughs> whoops. I had, I had a capacity available this whole time. All right, 10 more ancient magic spots. What else have we gotten for things? We've gotten some resistance ups. <laughs> this fucking terrifying demi guy's mask. Oh my god. Protego shielding. I wonder what that does. It's not like I can have Protego up a lot. It's like up for a second. But maybe it like just blocks out some of the bigger damage hits. All right, let's head back to Hogwarts. Uh, athletic house robe, astro robe. What do those look like? Ooh. All right, we got a pretty big offense upgrade. I'll take that. It's got a cute design too. This one makes me feel like a professor. This, that one does not. Is that all the orange 
key I currently have? Oh, done. Okay, fine. I'll get it upgraded, I guess. Okay. I've done my room of requirements shenanigans. It is it is a lot of busy work, which is why I I cut it out <laughs> a lot. If I ever like make changes in there, I'll keep them in. Or like the occasional like grabbing of stuff, but a lot of it is just running around pressing square. And then the biggest one is running around and feeding all of the animals, which uh ooh. feeding the animals, petting the animals with magic. And we don't even have all the rooms yet. It's going to take me a lot longer to do things next time. Or, well, not next time, but eventually. Pardon? Were you calling to me? I was. I'm Marianne Moffat. Hello. Pleasure. At the moment, I'm having a great deal of trouble trying to find a particular Derricol. Okay. Why do you... Why do you want one? Ah, yes. The magical bird can disappear when it senses danger. Peculiar things, aren't they? Did you know that muggles call them dodos? <laughs> Such a funny name. They are dodos? Oh my god. about a large albino derricol known as Gwenaira. She's a local legend, so of course poachers are after her. If I had her, I'd treat her like a queen. And I could use her molted feathers as fashion accessories. There it is. <laughs> I could keep her. <laughs> no, we've got enough deer calls. Seems you're more concerned with the feathers than the bird. But she'd be safer with you than with poachers. Indeed. They'd pluck her feathers and likely kill her when they were through. I can't seem to rescue her, and I'm worried the deer calls don't trust me since I've been hanging about their den. Yeah, I mean, I can go save them. Why well, are you fixated on Gwenaira and not rescuing Gwenaira. all the deer calls? Gwenaira is special. She's more attractive to poachers with her lovely plumage. They'll try harder to take her. The other Derricals seem to have managed evading poachers quite well on their own. Uh-huh. Can you tell me what the Derricol den looks like? It's down by the shore, on a sort of overhanging cliff. You'll recognize it by all of the Derricals lolling about. Well, all right. I'll go over I'll there, I guess. I'll out for a large white Derricol. Oh, thank you. Those gorgeous feathers. And she'd be safe. <laughs> One last thing. She seems to spend her days in hiding. I've only ever seen her at night. I do hope you're able to save her. Yeah. Be prepared to chase her. I sometimes wonder if she actually enjoys the pursuit. Well, I'll, I'll I'll wait until we're over there I to make a night time. Watch for Gwenaira at night, apparently. Or I can make a night and find the the demi guy statue. Well, I actually find the demi guy statue first, and then make it night time. If it's even possible for me, there might be level Hello, three gal locks galore or something. Yeah, she seems like a pretty shifty lady. Like, maybe I should keep it for myself, but like, to be fair, mechanically, all I'm using the animals for is the same thing, <laughs> right? Like, I really wouldn't be that much better of an option. But you know what? It gets fed every 30 minutes. Well, 25 plus minutes or so. Ooh. Oh my god, another cloak. I need other pieces. Can find us. What's hiding out down here? Oh, a dung bug. Or a dug bug. It's just... Having a little bit of a soak. Damn, this Crucio is just keeping it locked up. Holy hell. A 
asylum mask. That looks scary. Ooh. I should investigate. Chest. Nice. Ooh. I think that's exactly what we need. No. No, my gloves are okay. I need a hat. A hat and a scarf upgrade wouldn't be too bad, but especially the hat. Wait, did more dug bogs spawn? Oh shit! They came back for revenge! Ow! Oh my god! Oh, I fucked up! Levioso! Ah, oh, I just turned it into its tongue. Ah. Hey, I got it. And slice. But yeah, no, I, I need Doug Bug tongues. Doug bug tongue. Ooh, what a tongue twister. Uh, hey! Could have missed Moffat looking out for those poor Diracles. Yeah. <laughs> Miss Moffat only cares about using their feathers for what she calls fashion. Hey, but you know. Better than the Deary calls being killed, I guess. Now, demiguys, Revelio. What demiguys? What do we have here? A demiguys. Ah, <laughs> all right. Now we can make it nighttime. Short little ten-minute nap on the floor. Oh, hey, the demiguy statue's glowing. Yeah. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. I guess it would depend on what our character wants out of Alohomora. their life as a, as a as a witch. But it seems like life for anyone who's Uh, are you okay? So, <laughs> life's pretty good for the random citizen. They don't even need chairs. Who is Ada? My dearest Ada, I pine for you, my love. Each day we spend apart wears at my soul. We must find a way to meet soon. If we were to apparate to each other, where would we meet? I know that I am not welcome at your family's home in Marinweem. I have been speaking with the Cragcroft locals lately about the increased goblin presence here by the shore. They say Ranrock's loyalists may be seeking remnants of work left by a legendary wizard who lived here long ago. A man from the east, like me. This intrigued me. Apparently he had some secret work in the nearby mountain. It sounds as though this could be a perfect meeting space for us. I have an idea. This Thursday evening at dusk, will you apparate to the western side of the mountain? Aim for one of the vaults that the locals use to store their valuables. We should be safe from prying eyes there. It feels like only yesterday that we finished Hogwarts together. Two children with stars in their eyes and love in their hearts. Promise me that we will rediscover those stars in our eyes and forever protect that love in our hearts. My love always, Tarek. Wow. So romantic. My dearest Ada, first I must know, are you alright? What a disaster our rendezvous was. I am truly sorry for all of this. It was wonderful to see you in person after all this time. I just cannot believe how quickly those foul goblin loyalists became aware of our presence and set upon us. They seem to possess some kind of dark magic that I do not understand. It is a relief that you were able to disparate or disapparate quickly. I stayed and dealt with as many as I could, but left soon after. Why have these goblins taken over this area? What is it that they are looking for? I know one thing. Soon no one will be safe here. My love, we spoke briefly of eloping. Have you given any more thought to it? It seems as if the time for such drastic action may be approaching. We must go somewhere new so that we may start fresh. I have heard of small magical communities in Norway, some in Spain as well. I care, not, I care not where we go as long as I'm with you. Send your response with the fastest owl. 
I must know that you are all right, and I must know whether you are ready and truly willing to elope. My love always, Derek. Wow. Wait. A young woman's diary entry? Uh-oh. February 1890. We have made our decision. We will be eloping this coming Monday. I have been in contact with a kindly old witch in o Oslo who has agreed to give Tarek an apprenticeship. Should be grateful for my knowledge of wand, uh, wand woods as well. We will be able to start anew. I shall miss my family, but leaving is their fault, not mine. They refused to accept Tarek for his background, and therefore they refused me. I shall leave a note. They can know that I've left. Uh, they can know that I've left, and that I am happy elsewhere at the love of my life. The stirrings of goblin loyalists, not to mention poachers and ashwinders, have made this place unsafe. I hope my family leaves eventually as well. Either way, I, we, Tarek and I, will finally be far away. I have not told Tarek yet, but I am with child. I will wait until we are safe, then tell him the happy news. I cannot dare believe it. I will soon have a daughter or son of my own. A baby to raise with Tarek, safe in our new home. Perhaps one day, when they are of age, they will attend Hogwarts and bring our little family full circle. I am hopeful. The next journal entry I write will likely be from Norway. Goodbye, Marin Weem. You will always be in my heart. Aww. Well, I mean... That story seemed to have a positive ending. That's nice. That could have gone in so many different ways. Alright, well, actually... We'll use High Wing. In exchange for... Not having too much uh, controllability, I think we go a little bit faster on High Wing. I don't know, though. It's not like I have a meter to compare, compare speeds. Whoop. Oh, hey! Little balloons! Ooh, an astronomy table. Oh, gosh. And ancient magic, and another butterfly thing. Man, this, this place has a lot going for it! Ooh, and a landing pad, too? Gosh. And a camp on the furthest edges of the map. And rightfully so. Slow down now. Oh god. There we go. High wing! Go! <laughs> Up! Okay. Uh, no, no, not again. No need to race now, my friend. All right, go away. I'm swapping to my broom. Goodness. That tree over there, where the uh, Deary Call is. I should head over there. Maybe my broom is faster. I don't know. I feel like that number is ticking down this must pretty be quickly. The call den that Miss Moffat told me about. Now, where is Gwenaira? Hold on. Where is my <laughs> resto momentum? They gave us a pretty big... Oh, there she is! <laughs> nice try, Gunaira. Do cooperate, won't you? No, not you! What the... There we go. Now I need to let Miss Moffat know. Ooh. No. I don't actually know what theory calls I have at, uh... At home. No need. I'll look after you. I feel like all the ones we have... Are this shade? Wow, I slowed it in its teleportation. Uh, oops. <laughs> Arrest the momentum. 
What kind of secrets could it see in the moments it was frozen? Traveling through the dimensions. Professor Howen will never believe this. Alright. Let's go do some collectibles. Maybe I'll get a really good uh, aspect from this place or trait. Oh my god, there's so much moon crystal. Not that I super need it, I'm stinking rich. I probably have, that's all right. Not if you ain't wearing that goblin helm you stole. You and your miserable plants. Crucio! I shan't! <laughs> <laughs> I was just trying to get every single ability used. Control 2. Eh. Really what I want, I want level 3 spells. I wonder if they're like guaranteed. Like, oh, I could Google where the level 3 spells are and go after them directly. I won't. As I'm just a little bit lazy on that front. He's likely studied here. Ami um, he definitely has never been over here. Are you kidding me? What is this? Big snake? Ooh. Hmm. Maybe it's a little bit smaller. That doesn't sound good. Okay. What am I missing here? Because it seems like the, the clump of stars over here... See, yeah, they, they seem like they match up pretty nicely. But I guess I'm wrong? Oh my god, that rotation speed is so slow, holy shit. Goodness, I am lost on this. Okay. Is it just super big? Is that the problem? I need to zoom out a little bit more? Yeah. Hydra. Oh, wow. Kind of like a snake. Why is there? There's a troll down there. Hmm. I could go troll the troll. Revelio. Oh, this seems like an important place. Uh, maybe not. Money. It looked like a place that would be locked off for us for a while, but it wasn't. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. No, it won't let me fly in there. Fine. Uh, 
Oh, I did not see this here. I hear the whispers of ancient magic calling to me. Oh. Lumos. Gross. Confringo. Ah. Oh. Where's my Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. Oh god, no, come back! Oh, oh wow. Okay, I didn't know they would do that. Works for me. That solves that. Rebellion. Anything else out here? I should probably take this. So I think if I uh, sleep. Like, to pass the time, it uses the rest of my, uh, potion, because I- I just used that, like, not too long ago. I used it by accident inside of the Room of Requirement. So I gotta be careful about one that. Of those tables Slightly. Shaman Slightly. Oh. I was wondering if there was anyone in here. Uh oh. The butterflies are leaving! Come back! Lumos. Ooh, look at that. The butterflies all have their own little shadows. Oh, wait, we're going up. Oh, 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 plot twist. Giant purple toad statue. Oh. But the toads don't look too purple on that statue, so, like, how would I know that it was specifically a purple toad? You know? Alright, where am I anyways? Okay. We'll grab the Marinweem Ruins. Flu Flame real quick and then head out. You can also beat up this troll. Hello, River Troll! <laughs> Excuse me. Ooh. A little risky, huh? Well, I made it work. down here oh it's just the the bridge uh oh oh shit oh double shit 
Enjoy stealing him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I turned him into a chicken. Can Fringo? Wait, sorry, Lucia. <laughs> I guess I can't. Can't take that. I wasn't expecting to get ambushed. I just wanted this. What's so important about these ruins if they have to be defended like that? I see a Merlin trial. We got a Merlin trial, we got some chess. Another cave of disappointment. I know a Merlin trial when I see one. I think we have to do I think this is a lead the butterflies one. Rebellion. Or is it break them? Set test. Okay. Rebellion. Yep, there they are. Lewis. I agree. This place is pretty nice. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. You know, it's a good thing it belongs to you, Mr. Sheep. Oh, okay, I see the I see the other two. It is a lovely morning out. Sometimes the peace and quiet, the morning before the hustle and bustle of everything begins, it's pretty nice. I bet especially in a place like this where they wouldn't have any cars. It's just the sounds of animals and the wind. That's that. Settled. You know, I agree, Sheep. I think the geopolitical situation in the Wizarding World is a shame. And I hope that it gets drastically better. Too bad it's probably gonna take a hundred plus years for it to happen. 